If your head's not in neutral and you're looking up, all right, so if you stand up, karepe, that's not a normal body shape. You want to be as normal and as square as you can. So nice neutral head. Hey guys, Tete de Faulkner here from the New South Wales Waratahs. Today I'm gonna to take you through a couple of prop exercises. I've got a couple of helpers. We've got Karpe, eight, who's eight years old. Much of who's 10 years old. Uh, we're gonna go through a warm up, uh, our six principles of scrummaging, and then I'll take you through a couple of drills. But let's get it, eh? Uh, guys, this is our warm-up for today. We've got two exercises. We've got bear crawl up, uh, reverse bear crawl back, into frogs. Uh, so just with these, um, our bear crawls are going to be for speed, uh, not so much scrum shape uh, until a little bit later. Uh, and our frogs, if you haven't done frogs before, um, what you're going to do is you're going to put your hands together, you've got your elbows uh, inside your knees, and all you're doing is getting as low as you can just to really open up those hips. So you're going to go as low as you can, up, that's one, two, three, that's gonna, you're gonna do 10 of them, okay? So the warm up was bear crawl up, reverse bear crawl back, um, straight into 10 frogs, you can do that twice, okay? So we're warming up the shoulders, hips, and legs. So the boys are gonna demonstrate. Ready, three, two, one, go. Touch, you're gonna touch the line, come back, straight into frogs, 10 frogs. So focusing on nice and getting nice and low. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. As soon as they're done, they go again. Off you go. Touch the line, come back. Ten frogs again. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And hopefully by that. Uh, by the end of that, they're going to be pretty warm. Hips are going to be nice and open. Ready to go. Legs are ready. Shoulders are good. Let's get it. Hey guys, so we're going to talk through our six principles. Um, this, these are the processes that we go through just before we go into a scrum or we bind onto each other. So Machu is actually going to speak through the six principles. The first principle is that your toes have to be straight. Your knees just slightly over your toes. Your hips square. Your chest out and your shoulders square, your head neutral. Ready? Crouch. Alright, so if you look here, it's not too bad. Just an example, if your head's not in neutral and you're looking up, alright, so if you stand up, Karepe, that's not a normal body shape. You want to be as normal and as square as you can. So, nice neutral head if you go crouch. Alright, he's got that nice straight back, nice straight head, everything's in line <clears throat> and, and facing forward. That's what we want to see before we engage. And same here with Machu as well. Alright, so we're just going to go through a couple of exercises just for you guys to do at home. Uh, especially when we want the kids to be ready as soon as rugby is ready, uh, we're ready to go. But um, we're just going to do kind of like a plank hold uh, but scrum position style. Uh, so much will show us and demonstrate uh, all we're going to do is 30 seconds on 30 seconds off we'll do this about three or four times it's just just gets the core going um, and keeps that nice scrum shape as long as you keep talking to the um, kids about their shape um, and they're holding it under tension uh, especially when it's timed as well 30 seconds is quite quite long but uh, this is going to work out really well in the long run so ready crouch bind Set. Right, so we've got 30 seconds. We're going to time it here. Uh, just with the shape, um, to bring your belly up a little bit, hips down. Okay. Just make sure the hips are nice and square. Um, they're not angling down. Shoulders up a little bit. So they're still in that nice neutral position. Uh, knees are at a good angle. So we've got 10 seconds. Still nice and high. He's not angling down, he's not angling up. That's uh, a nice position. Two. One, stop. Uh, so then, you'll, then you'll go 30 seconds off. Uh, we'll go two, two more times, and that's one set. Maybe go two, three sets. Uh, this is the second drill. Uh, what Machi's going to do is he's going to find his scrum shape, um, but he's just going to have a partner who gives him a little bit of pressure, um, kind of pushing in all diff different positions, uh, different spots. Uh, he's just got to focus on keeping that shape 
um, that we've talked about at the start and keep it in because his body shape nice and strong it's nice and stiff right, so you go much easier nice and good, good scrum shape that's it karape provide a little bit of pressure so all karape is doing is pushing in different spots even if i'm here as well i can kind of give him a little bit more three two one down i swap so if you've got a partner you're going to go 10 seconds one person 10 seconds the other that's it shoulders up that's it right. so just like i did there just keep uh keep telling him uh what, what his come take like if he's angling down angling up hips are low hips are high just keep him um keep talking to him three two one change again so just with this drill here, you can go three times, four times. Uh, and the hips up, hips up. That's it. Uh, depending on uh, kind of what level you're at, uh, where the kids are, um, it, it's totally dependent on the skill level. Two, one, change. We'll go once more. The knee sport. That's it. Head in neutral. Great work. So this drill nice and easy. Uh, if you've got a partner, it'd be perfect. Uh, if not, you can just hold that nice strong uh, scrum position. Three, two, one, break. That's it. Uh, thanks guys for um, joining us today. I know Machu, Karaka and myself all enjoyed to help, hopefully teaching you guys um, so that you have new skills to either do it at home, and when the training comes and, and the season comes back on, uh, you guys are ready for the season. Uh, but we just want two points, our main points to come away with. Um, we want you to take that on to your teams or even yourselves. So much we'll have our first point. First point is the six principles. Something goes wrong in your scrum, just check the six principles to see which one you left out. Part of it. Second point is just Remember to enjoy your scrumming training. Uh, just on that point, uh, we just want you to enjoy uh, everything about it, just like your kick and your passing, um, and obviously scoring tries, everything like that. It's obviously real fun. I feel like in junior level especially, um, there's a lack of either information or drills towards scrummaging. Um, so if these, these can help uh, bring your either your child or even further up seniors up to a level that they need to be or to enjoy this part of the game um, hopefully these can help but thank you again uh, and hopefully you guys enjoyed that